So our dried chili pepper quilts egg is ready. And we also have our deep fried quilts egg. So I'm going to let my two tasters taste it and let me know what they think about the quilts egg. <laughs> Hello everyone, so today we're going to make a very simple dish with quail's egg. We are going to do some deep fried quail's egg with this batter. We're going to use that. I'll tell you what it in it later and then I'm also going to use that and make some um, dry chili pepper quilts egg okay so for that we have some dried chilies over here I think I have about 12 to 15 uh, just cut into two and then I have about one inch of uh, ginger sliced into strips then I have one onion uh, finely diced uh, sorry finely chopped and then we have about six cloves of garlic chopped finely again and then this is um, I used one green chili and half red chili you can use however much of chili you want um, I'm just using what I have at home you can also use chili padi and yeah that's about it and here I have some shrimps some dried shrimps and this one is a mixture of soy sauce so i have light soy sauce i have dark soy sauce uh, some oyster sauce and generous amount of black pepper mixed in it so i'll share the details of the quantity of the sauces in the video later so let's get cooking before that to let you know what's in the batter i have uh, mixed some uh, flour so it's normal tepung gandum wheat flour with some potato starch and salt and pepper i've just added a few dashes of paprika powder but not too much because i don't want it spicy for my son so yeah just mix it with some um, water and also two eggs so two normal eggs two normal chicken eggs and just mix it to get this kind of uh, consistency and we are ready to f boil first the quail's egg and then deep fry it okay so first we're going to boil the quail's egg uh, just put it into some water and leave it on the stove to boil for about seven minutes or so and once that is done take it out uh, would be good to put it in some cold water to stop it from cooking and then we will peel the eggs so I just learned a hack um, on how to peel the quail's egg so once you have boiled it and put it in cold water to um, cool it down and stop it from cooking then we put it into like a tupperware or a container like this and then just shake shake it around okay not too much just to lightly crack the shell and then we will open and peel the shell from the top then put it in some water just add some water inside and then peel it from the top like this so you find the crack and peel it These are the peeled eggs, is how it looks like. And now we are going to deep fry it with the batter. Okay, so I've just put it into sticks like this. And then I'm going to dip it into the batter that I showed you earlier. And deep fry in the oil. Okay, so we'll heat the oil. And then just put in the stick like this to see if it's hot enough once you see it bubbling means the oil is ready so now we can deep fry our quills eggs so we put in the quills eggs one by one with the sticks let it fry for a while and then we'll turn it around just about one minute on each side and we can take it up okay now it's ready we just take it out Okay, now we're going to prepare the dry chili pepper quail's egg. So let the oil heat in a pan. And then we are just going to put in some dried shrimps. 
Okay, saute that for a bit. Okay, when it is semi-fried, we're going to put in all the other ingredients. Onions, garlic, chilies, fresh chilies. Ginger, and we're gonna put half of uh, the dried chilies that we had now. We're gonna stir all of that in. Now we'll add some oil because it's getting a bit dry. Look at the beautiful colors. Okay, so we're just going to sauté it all together, just fry it all in together. Let the aroma come out. Once it starts smelling good and all the raw smell is out, we'll pour in the sauces mix. Okay, we're going in with the sauce now. Okay, now we're going to add in all the other dried chilies that we had earlier. Put all that in. So we do this because it'll be a, you'll get extra spice from it if you add some later. Okay, everything is cooked. Now we're going to add in the quail's egg. Just give it a stir, cook for about a minute or so, and we are ready to take it out. Smells good, Amma. Thank you. Okay, so we mix everything in, all the quills egg are in and we have mixed everything in well. So now we just have to dish it out and it's ready to serve. So our dried chili pepper quills egg is ready and we also have our deep fried quills egg. So I'm going to let my two tasters taste it and let me know what they think about the quills egg. Yum! Mmm! Try it, huh? Yum, me. Do you like it, the quills egg, Mitre? Yummy! Show me thumbs up, lah. Yay! Okay, now our pasta. Thank you. Yum. Yeah, I'm going to try the pedas one, huh? Okay. Are you ready? Mm. 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 Nice. Sedap. This one. Yay! Yeah. You just have some rice. And on bak choy or what not. This one. Chatul. Sedap. Yay! Okay. Yummy! Yeah, yummy! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that's a wrap guys See you in the next video Bye.